So the anal stage or anal type of personality, uh, we go through this stage when we are, we went through the stage when we were like between year and a half and three years old. And the focus of libido, and again, this is the part of the body where child receives the biggest pleasure, pleasure is anus. And um, the child must learn how to control his bodily needs, the ability to control his body. And this stage is where uh, the child uh, develops a sense of control, a sense of accomplishment and independence. If uh, the child went, uh, through the stage successfully, then he grows up into a com competent adult, a person with good self-esteem, uh, a person who can control himself, a person who can control his life, a person who can control money, a person who can create gold, uh, goals, and a person who is successful financially. And people who had a uh, fixation on this stage uh, and fixation is formed when parents were too controlling, uh, when parents did not reward the child for learning how to use a potty, those people develop anal type of personality. And children who had problems with the constipation or diarrhea might develop two types of personality. It can be an obsessive controlling behavior or a person with a messy type of personality, person who cannot be in charge of anything. So there are two opposite type of personality. And obsessive controlling behavior uh, is the fixation on holding feces. When the person had too much stress, a child had too much stress, too much fixation, too much tension on holding his feces. When the child was uh, trying so hard uh, to to hold his feces in order not to poop to his pants. And uh, as an adult, we might see a person who wants uh, to control everything. Everything should be on its place, uh, on its order. Um, a person with OCD personality disorder, a person who has a spotless house, a woman who has a spotless kitchen, everything is organized in, at her kitchen, in her kitchen, uh, a person with a spotless office, uh, a woman with a spot or a man with a perfect closet where clothing uh, is sorted by type and color, mm. A person who likes to be in control, who never late, uh, and he might actually get angry if he is late. He will feel shame, and he is not okay when other people are late. He's gonna judge other people for being late. Uh, here we're gonna have a person who spends money only on necessary things, uh, who likes to save money, mm, and. He might even have a hard time of spending money on himself. He will not buy expensive stuff because it's a waste of money unless it's uh, ex absolutely necessary. And here we're also going to have a good girl syndrome or good boy syndrome. Uh, it's desire to be perfect, desire to be good, desire to be the best in everything. And the person who is going to intellectualize and rationalize uh, his uh, decisions, his life, and this person is um, not gonna be any... These people are, are not usually creative people because they have to block the creativity. Creativity is when you let things go the way they are, you open and you have no expectations. Then you create new things like an artist or musician or a dancer. And those people, they are always in control. They cannot uh, just relax and let things go.